Jesus says, those who do the will of my father are my brothers and sisters and mother. Dear brothers and sisters, how far are we from the kingdom of God? Or how close are we to the kingdom of God? Perhaps we need to find an answer to this question during this season of Lent. And the gospel today presents to us an important parameter to use for ourselves in order to know where do we stand in our relationship with the kingdom of God. This parameter is a very core and the purpose of human existence. We exist and find fulfillment for our lives in our relationship with God and our brothers and sisters. To put it more strongly, we find our fulfillment for our lives only when we connect ourselves with God and our fellow human beings. Therefore, the better we grow closer to God and the others, the more we are content with ourselves. Based on this parameter, we could draw three categories of people. They are those who are far from the kingdom of God, those who are close to the kingdom of God, and those who are in the kingdom of God. Who are those who are far from the kingdom of God? They are those who live a life completely against the values of God's kingdom. They live by their own rules and God and fellow humans do not matter to them. Perhaps the words of the demons whom Jesus encountered would fit well for them. What have you to do with us, Jesus of Nazareth? Or even the words of Cain would also fit well for them. Am I the keeper of my brother? Second category of people are those who are very close to the kingdom of God. In the words of Jesus, those who are not far from the kingdom of God. People like Nicodemus fall into this category because they knew the very core of human existence. They knew that they ought to love God and their neighbors. And that is more important than any rituals and sacrifices. But their knowledge did not convert into action. Nicodemus made efforts to go beyond the knowledge. But many Pharisees and scribes got stuck in knowing the right thing but either they neglected the right response to that or turned away from it. This leads to the third category of people. They are those who not only know that God should be the first priority of their life and others are important for them, but also they live in such a way that this knowledge is reflected in their lives. Jesus says, those who do the will of my father are my brothers and sisters and mother. It is not limited to knowing, but knowledge converted into action. Whenever we make efforts to convert our knowledge of the kingdom of God into action, then to us, the Lord would say, you are a son or a daughter in my kingdom. Amen. <laughs>